Ron. Speaking of nice guys, welcome back, Ron. Thank you. I'm happy to be back. All right, uh, I'm going to give you uh, I'm going to give you an opportunity to talk about your event and then get out of here because you're Mason. You shouldn't be involved in this. <laughs> you're right. We circumscribe our passions, so that it teaches us not to get jump into stuff like like this. So okay. Well, sometimes you know you I'm won't more be political. A, sometimes you, I'm a journalist. Sometimes you, I'm a lot. Then of you won't be a Mason for long. I hope you <laughs> um, I enjoy it while you can. I don't think you can help yourself. But okay, what's the <laughs> event quickly? And I got to move on. Well, the event is an open house. This is the first time our Masonic Lodge has ever been open to the public. People can come inside for two hours, 7 p.m. to 9 p.m. Come inside, see our assembly room with all the cool stuff, ask you the questions that you have. We will have refreshments. We're giving away a prize from Whiskey Jacks. Mm. And uh, it's really is what the, the thing is, like, I've lived in that town my entire life. Until May, when I was initiated, I'd never seen inside that building. So a lot of people that drive by have been curious about what is a Masonic yeah. Lodge like on the inside. You have two hours to, tonight to come down and see. It's and tonight. it's tonight. It's tonight, yeah. Right. Yeah, and, and this is in Westmoreland. Westmoreland, okay. seven seven two seven West Main Street in Westmoreland. We're right off the Village Green. If you're at Nice and Easy, you can just look across and see us. And uh, it's a really rare opportunity to see what it's like in, inside and to ask all your questions. I'm not going to be the one answering the questions. I'll be the one greeting because I don't I don't know all the answers. I don't know what I. You know, it's always been quite a private, uh, unless it, you're a member. It absolutely is. Yeah. So yeah, yeah, so this is a really unusual opportunity and very. Cool and interesting and mysterious. And are you a uh, or are you a Freemason or have they captured you? I am <laughs> <laughs> just wondering. I am a first degree Mason. Can you explain to me the difference? What is a Freemason and what is uh, explain why it's called the Freemasons? Well, it, it it grew out of the guilds that were actual Masons in the uh, medieval times. The Masons were the people who literally built the cathedrals and stuff. Mm-hmm. And what happened was in the 1700s, people just other professions wanted to to be involved in it and to uh to meet together and to have a chance to have fellowship and to Fair improve enough. themselves as people not just as professionals and this so very ex- just some, something else this very exclusive uh b- it's not very exclusive no well now it is now you have the opportunity to kind of tour everything tonight and well for two hours yeah, yeah for two hours right, after right. that it's exclusive again well i mean <laughs> you can always you can always you can always apply for membership okay so. all right fair enough what time yes. tonight again 7 p.m okay. to 9 p.m thank you Ron, thank you, and for tolerating us this morning. No problem. All right, thank you. <laughs> uh, I don't always agree with your politics, but uh, I agree with your passion. Thank you. Okay. Be more Westmo. Leon Etienne is uh, going to be performing tomorrow at the Turning Stone Resort and Casino. It's going to be an awesome show, Magic Rocks. And I want to give him a chance to quickly uh, plug how to get tickets for tomorrow. There's an afternoon and a night show. Good morning, Leon Etienne. Good morning, Bill. How are you? Good morning, Keeler, Keeler in the Morning listeners. Uh, I am doing fantastic. Uh, thank you one more time for getting me on to talk about the show at the casino tomorrow. So, yeah, we're we're here, man. It's uh, one day away. There's a 3 p.m., 7 p.m. show. You can call 315-361-SHOW for tickets, and you can also visit Ticketmaster.com. Now, here's the catch. There's been a few issues using Ticketmaster, so if you don't see the tickets you want, Please call the box Mm. office, and they will be more than happy to help you out. They might have better seats through the box office. Fair enough. They absolutely do. I do that, too, to this day. I still call venues. I I do, too. I I do use Ticketmaster sometimes, but if you don't see anything you like, go and call the venue, and they'll hook you up. I have to tell you, when Train uh, played at the the Turning Stone, I had Ticketmaster on computer, and I had 361 show um, (laughs) on the phone, (laughs) and I was comparing, and I I ended up... uh, Cutting off the Ticketmaster, I got better seats yeah. through, uh, Dude, through the Turning Stone always. box office. So, so call the Turning Stone box office, Jackie. The girls in the office are so great; they'll hook you guys up. Yeah. Uh, okay, Leon. Good luck. Three six one show. It's tomorrow, and get out there to see him. Thank you so much, Leon. Thank you. Thank mm. you, guys. Bye bye. One of our gems in the area is uh, Leon Etienne.